Hello everybody, the Warrior Panda here, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Ford, The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. Last time we started off the game, we started out as Link, surprisingly, and we had to save Zelda from this monster thing. I'm pretty sure it isn't Ganon, but somebody else that we don't know the name of, but... Link also got swapped out by this uh, Rift thing, and we started playing as Zelda, and we uh, had to go over to our castle to... Me back up with the king, and then the king and all, a couple of other people got sucked into the rift, and they put us in jail, and they were going to execute us, but we escaped, and now we are here with the cloak and this uh, tree person, and also this wand that can uh, make echoes and stuff like that. So, yeah, now we're going to explore the rest of this place, and uh, I can already see more rupees that we can get underwater. So I have to be careful because of these urchin things. Got a blue, another blue rupee. There's another blue rupee. Oh, that seems very familiar. I really want that heart piece. I'm pretty sure you're going to be able to get it. So we need to switch over to beds. We're going to bed our all the way, all the way over to this heart piece. It's our very first one of many, I am sure. Then we also lay on it, which is pretty cool. Let's jump up here and... Oh, wait. Um... Okay, so we need to do this. Oh, crap. Uh... And now do this, and there we go. I can see how many, like, a lot of different puzzle situations can be solved in, like, a million different ways. Uh. Ow. Ow. I'm kinda confused. I think you need to pick up the rock and throw it at the urchin enemy and uh, you also learn the sea urchin echo. Now we got getting the echo monsters too. Do you learn to echo that monster? Defeating me monsters leaves a shimmer which allows you to learn about them like like you just did. Monsters learn with the R can be echoed with Y. You can direct your echoes to attack specific targets by using tar Target with ZL. So let's just attack these guys and uh Oh wait, so I'm gonna have to use another an urchin to attack that one. So wait, I we just leave this place because we can go back down there and defeat those enemies to get more rupees, but we'll just keep doing that as we continue on further. I don't want to waste time. Oh crap. <laughs> Die, please! We got a keys echo, too. Uh, goodbye. I wanted to grab that rupee. Okay, so I think... Yeah, there's another heart piece here. So very close by, we keep finding another heart piece. Uh, is that what you're supposed to do? I'm not, I don't think that's what you we were supposed to do. So you, you need to first get one of these uh, the tables so we can place it here. And uh, now we're gonna need to use beds to get up to that ne upper platform. Oh crap, um, how? Okay. Okay, there we go. Now we're on top of here, so now we need to use the sea urchin to place down here that will break all those blocks so we can grab this next heart piece. Pretty awesome. And now I want to 
Take that back. It's all gonna have to get very used to all this, like, Wicca Echoes stuff. Okay. okay. There we go, got you. Now we can learn the Zol Echo. So now we can leave up here. So now we're outside at the southern prairie, and uh, uh, right away I see a chest there that I'm pretty sure we can get right away if we use the echoes. We can start off by making a table here and putting a table here and also putting a, a box there and open up the chest. And we get 50 rupees! Hooray! We're probably going to be able to buy something soon. I want to call this grass to get a lot of, uh, a lot more rupees. Already the music is really nice, I really like, really like it. Oh, come on, no rupees there, seriously? Only getting a couple of rupees every time I I cut little bits of grass. But we're here at the Southern Village. Let's talk to this guy. Oh. Welcome to Southern Village. It's usually nice and quiet here, but now things are terrible. If only Link were here. Who's Link? Who's this Link you're talking about? What happened? Oh. Rift appeared north of here, and it grew so fast that one of us got caught inside. What's worse is we can't even run into Iron Castle for help. For help, the Rift is blocking the way there. If only Link were here. Who's Link? Oh. Link is a young fellow from the vill this village. He's better with a sword than anyone. He helps us with lots of problems, monsters, the weeds, you name it. But he's got off on a journey, right where we needed him. I'm curious, Link wears a cloak like, like yours. I think I hope you're all right. Okay. Let's check this house. Uh, nothing really. I'm not gonna keep cutting the grass every time we re-enter re a house just because they disappear. But first, we can learn this uh, new echo, this pot echo. We can also pick up the pot, and uh, she gets uh, she kind of gets mad at us. Ooh. We're pretty upset around here. One of us villagers got caught in a rift, and we can't ex escape either. The forest nearby is crawling with monsters. I want to be able to pick up that wooden sword and fight monsters with it, but I assume that probably won't do anything. talk to you. Yeah. I, got, I got a trampoline. What a great gift. You can play with it too. Hi. The wrist falls up one of my neighbors. There must be something we can do besides pacing. Yep. Boing, boing. Yep. Boing, boing, boing. We can jump higher. Yay, this is so fun. I can spend hours doing that, but except I'm not. Yeah. There's your bias huge and it's terrifying being so close to our village. Could be in the forest too. A strange old man lives there. I hope he's okay. Ooh, I want that. Welcome! Potions, sweets, you'll find a tasty selection here at the Southern Shop. Come on in and take a look. Hey! I'm gonna help you. I'd like to... Uh. Please let me know if you need me. Yeah! Pieces of fire! Oh, we can barely buy that, so I think I'm definitely gonna do that. You got a third piece of heart! And we'll click one more and we get another heart container! Uh. We barely have any rupees le left, though, but... I wanna see what this is first. Yeah! Floor nectar! The effects of other ingredients? No, no thank you for now. Yeah. Red potion. Hmm. I need to get more rupees though. At least we got that. Check inside this house. Nobody in here. This might actually be Link's house. Because he has a Link hat there. So what's over here? Uh, we can also grab this. Sign Echo. I'm not sure how well useful that would be. Okay, let's keep cutting this grass. What's that? 
Hey Zelda, have a look at this! This waypoint has been recorded. You can now warp, warp you using the, the map. Or it, it lit up. These are waypoints. We used to this, these a lot. Rifts can appear all over the place, so we use these to travel quick, quickly around the world. Once you interact with one, you can travel it to at any, any time. I'm sure they'll be helpful. Okay. Waypoints, waypoints can be found in lots of different places. If you spot any, make sure you check them out. Nice, so we can warp here. We're at the southern forest now. I'm sensing lots of creatures in this area. I think this place is marked with the dawn is up ahead. Okay, so definitely I need to grab out our sea urchins so we can take them out. There we go. Die! Okay. Okay, so we want to go over here and place a table right here. We know not that, that we need to place a table here, and so we can jump up here and also. Uh, I think place a table there and. Place one here, and then place a wooden box. And now we can get up here, so we can grab this chest. Got, uh, 20 rupees! So now we can go over here. And we also need to grab this old bed. So we can get across. And die! Die! An open chest. Got five electro apples. This one I'm going to use to recover hearts in, but it's more effective when mixing into a drink. I'm sure we'll figure out how to do that soon. I just love spinning to make it go slightly faster when we do that. Let's check this cave. Ooh, it's kind of spooky. Die! What's over here? I'm not sure if you, like, get any more coins if you break the pots, but you did get another Electro Apple. Okay, so we need to pick up this rock and throw it at this fire enemy. Oh, wait, uh... Some rock salt, I guess. Wait, are you serious? Are you serious? There we go. We can learn the Ignizol Echo, and we're on fire. Oh crap, yeah. Definitely need some health soon. They die. Ow, come on! Okay. I'm really hoping getting this grass will give me a heart. Really nothing? Okay, well, at least we can go over here to... the Ignizol, so we can light up this... torch the... Thanks so the door can open. There's blue rupee there, which is nice. Now let's see what's in the chest. 
It's a fairy bottle! Hooray! First out of many, I assume, empty bottles that we can put stuff in. I hope there's fairies around that we can grab so we can... If we die, we don't have to worry about it. Do we get any hearts if we break these pots again? I know, we can get another one of those. Okay, let's move on forward. Okay. Oh crap, uh... Okay, so we got this, uh, rope echo. Pretty sure that means we'll be able to rope something towards us. Oh yes, we got a heart at least, so now we don't have to hear that annoying beeping anymore. Oh, come on! What's over here? Um, Let's go inside this cave. It's another side sc scrolling level and already another heart piece that we'll be able to get another heart container from. Which I really, really want. First, let's like, ignite this uh, guy here. Oh crap, oh uh, yeah, we're literally about to die. Ooh, this is bad. Well, let's learn this here. We get a... Uh, Caromadillo Echo. I really need to learn that uh, Ignite Power because so I don't ac accidentally die by, by it. But let's use this so we can... We can roll through the boxes. So here we get Refreshing Grapes. So now we can climb up here. Ooh, miss me! Let's quickly get this heart container! Or heart piece, but it got, now we also got another heart container, so now we have four. Which is awesome. So now we're back out here. Okay, let's go to the left here. I know we have a new enemy for us, but first I do want to try to use the... It's here. Come on, get on, get on fire! Aha, you're dead! So now we can learn this new one. The Spear Moblin Echo! So that means we can set... Oh, that's where it's fair! That's fair, I assume we can get to put in our bottle. Already we have a lot of echoes. Yeah. Go, come on, gra grab it. Okay, that's awesome. Fairy jumped into your bottle, hooray! Now we don't have to worry about dying. Now let's head up here. Okay, let's learn this. Got the meat echo. Okay, let's start out by sending in our spear moblin. Die! There we go. Okay, let's send out another guy. Come 
want to get on set on fire. And now we can open that chest. At least I'm sort of getting hit the hang of this, uh, all these echoes. But first, we need to actually get on up there to get the chest. No, not that. Please, I want to place it in the right spot. There we go. Ugh. Oh. Go, now we can open it. We got ten bunches of refreshing grapes. So now I want to go here, over here to the left real quick. We're on the trees there for a second. Hmm. What well, was this there where we were supposed to go? Looks like the rift is blocking the door. It's not that my role is to bend rifts. I have lots of friends who do the same. We all work together fixing the rifts. Normally my friends fix them quickly, so it's weird that it's this is still here. I wonder if something happened to them. Zelda, will you investigate with me? Sure. I'm guessing my friends will are in the rift. And if we find them, we can mend this rift easily. Let's head this way. We'll, we'll, we'll need to find an entry point. Okay, so we can't do anything going that way. I thought I saw a blue rupee down there for some reason. And now we need to head down here. And there's another enemy. Then we can take out with the flames. And die! Catch on fire! Ow, oh, of course I got hit. Any rupees? Only one. Oh, come on, why do I keep getting hit? We're in another cave. Seriously, spinning it like this is so much fun. Okay, so I'm gonna need to start igniting this big guy here. Come on, set it on fire! Huzzah! Now we've learned this pea hat echo. Ah, uh, pea hats are, yeah, are such classic Zelda enemies. Really, the only reason to come in here was to learn that new echo. Really wasn't any other reason. I still would really like to get a heart. Okay, so I think... Need to place a bed here, and then we can, we can get up that way. Oh, we got another uh, waypoint thing, so we can fast travel here too. A lot of rift stuff. I knew it! I can sense my friends in there. But they can't move. It seems like they're trapped. If that's the case, they won't be able to mend their rift at all. I think we'll have to go in there and help them. I think that we can deal with this first first pop properly. We can save them if we work together, Zelda. So what do you say? Hmm. 
All right, we can get in there now. Let's go save my friends. All right, let's go, Winter. This is the stilled southern for southern southern forest. This is the still world. Everything you see is floating around here, and here was sucked in through the rift. Anything that, that ends up here will be going to break apart and eventually vanish completely. Me and my friends have been the ability to restore things that have ended up in rifts, though. Speaking of, I says my friends are deeper in here. In here. Let's go, Zelda. All right. I think yeah. If we get a bed here, I didn't try this out, but we can also rest. That will heal up our HP. That's another way you don't need to actually you have have like a uh, potions or hard things if you want to do that. Oh boy, um, I think I'm gonna use this newly gotten pea hat to take care, care of this enemy. Oh boy, oh crap. Die keys. It's so great to be, to use uh, actual pea hats to fight enemies. That's not creepy at all. When people get pulled into the rifts, they kind of petrify and can't move anymore. And if they stay that way, they'll eventually fade away. That won't happen to you, Zelda. You're special. What? Yes, sir, I am. Okay, so we got more enemies here. Oh, crap. Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Let's send in another pea hat Oh crap, uh... I keep falling! There we go, now we can at least step on this switch to open up the, the gate. Hop and hop and hop again. Oh boy, um Let's grab this uh floral ne floral, floral nectar. Take you all out. There we go. Door door open. Not sure if you get anything from breaking those blo boxes. Just one rupee. Okay, let's explore this more of this outside area. And of course, I fell. At least you don't take damage when you do that. Let's first go down here. Okay, so I want to take out that enemy with the pea hat. I'm going to be using the pea hat uh, echo a lot more than the other enemy type echoes. What that ruby? And in this chest here. We get a purple ruby! It's 50 rupees! Okay. Get all this grass. Oh no! Oh, gosh. Okay. There we go. Now you're down. Uh, let's see what's up here.
I remember this one from the castle. I can store it back to normal for you, man. This man, this rift. That's like minister left, I think. You have to do all these sorts of platforming. Get another blue rupee. Jump, keep jumping, and let's see what's inside here. This is where you, you were trapped not too long ago. We're getting closer to my friends. They're farther in, but we're getting there. Southern ruins, so we can get this new waypoint. Side here, and I'm actually gonna end this episode off here, guys. We'll continue exploring this ruins in the next part, guys. So, if you like this part, be sure to subscribe to my channel, leave a like and post a comment about what you thought of the video. And I'll see you guys next time for more of my Let's Play 4 The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. Have a wonderful day, guys, and peace out.